The solar analemma shows the movement of the sun over a year. The sun moves between the tropics. We're told that the orbit of the Earth is nearly a perfect circle. If so, the analemma should be shaped like an infinity sign. And the ratio of the loop should be almost one to one. Here's an analemma under construction. You can see the shadow pointer marking out a dot at 8am. This figure took a year to inscribe and it's the reverse of what this sun actually does in the sky. Do you notice how different the loops are? The small loop is the winter loop and the large loop is the summer loop. Passover happens in mid-April. Just pretend for a moment the Earth is a flat disk. The Sun spirals between the two tropics and circles the Earth in one day. The Sun would speed up as it moved toward Capricorn and slow down as it moved toward Cancer. And the size of the tropical circles would reflect the speed of the Sun and the distance it covers. Here's a reversed tracing of the analemma photo. Here at 33 degrees south latitude, the sun is high in December, summer, and low in June, winter. I measured the length of the loops and their ratio. So the distance and the speed ratio is 1.5. Those numbers are the radii of the two tropics. I wondered what the ratio would be between the two tropical circles. Here's the math. Circumferences of tropics, radius from North Pole to Cancer equals 6025, 2 pi r. Same for the Capricorn circle. And the ratio of circles is 1.67. And that's bloody close to 1.5. So I'm starting to wonder if maybe this is where we live.